so Leviathan by Akakok. We are in C standard tuning and it starts here with three on the bottom string, four on the A and we're going to move that shape down to one of the bottom string, two of the A and then an F sharp power chord, so second fret on the bottom string. Then we have six of the bottom string, four of the A, three of the bottom string, two of the A, and then a second fret power chord. And then repeat that, so. And that's the opening riff. Then we have this riff. So power chords on the bottom string. Two, three, open two. Then we're going to play on the A fret four, on the D fret four, open G. Then we're going to do the same chords. And we're going to play four on the A, four on the D, open B. Same chords. Four, four, and then two on the B. And then same chords, but we're going to play the three on the B. So again, slowly. Then when the other guitar comes in, this is going to play the same chords and you're going to add in a bottom open string. And then the third fret. Then we're going to roll the volume off a little bit so we've got a less heavy sound I'm going to play. So we're playing two on the bottom string, four on the A, four on the D, and then we're going to play E, A, D, G, and the G's open, and then E, A, D, B. Then we're going to play E, A, D, G twice. But the second time round, we're going to come straight back to the bottom string. And then we're going to play the G and then the B. And then the last time, we're going to play the open bottom string. So here's the sequence again. Then we're going to play those intro chords again. And then we're into this riff. So we're playing seven of the bottom string. Seven, sorry, yeah, seven on the bottom string, nine, eight on the A string, seven on the bottom to nine on the A, so, and then the second time, which is nine, uh, seven, nine, eight, seven, nine, eight, seven, so slowly. And then we're going to play the same pattern on the fourth fret. Then 
Then we're going to play over the top of that riff. Okay, so that's seven on the bottom string, nine on the A, bend the A on the D up a semitone. And then the same on the four, so that's four on the bottom string, six on the A, bend up the fifth on the D a semitone. Then we have this riff. So playing a power chord on the fourth fret of the bottom string and then a harmonic just behind the fourth fret on the A string. Okay, so we play that through a few times and then we've got... So that's six of the D string and the open G, and then we're also going to put in here the eighth of the B string. And at the end of the riff, we slide up to 12 on the B, and the other guitar underneath is just playing those power chords again on the fourth fret of the bottom string and then five times going to play this harmonic. Then we're going to repeat those sections. And, and then we're into this riff. So we are channel picking 4th fret of the bottom string to the harmonic on the A and then muted twice on the G here on the 3rd fret and then the 4th fret and the harmonic again that was really sloppy but you know you get the idea and then 3-4-3 three, three on the bottom string record this video I'm using a Yamaha Revstar RSP20CR, a Victory Kraken head into a Zilla Fat Baby 1x12 with a Celestian Vintage 30. I hope you're enjoying the video, if you are make sure you give it a like, subscribe, hit the little bell for notifications and I'll see you later. Then we have this. <laughs> So playing seven, six, seven on the E. Do that four times. Then we're down to, and we're gonna, then we're gonna mute it and tremolo pick. And we're gonna play two, three, six on the A. Then two, three, one. Then back to two, three, six, two, three, one on the A. And then over the top of that we've got. Oh, it sounds like that. It could be this. It's hard to hear exactly what's going on. But let's take let's take this one. So we're gonna play six on the no we're not, we're gonna play eight on the G, five on the B. Gonna play the add the six in here, so and then we're gonna bring the 
take the pinky off and play seven of the G. So that's five of the B, eight of the G. Add in the six here. That's if it's that version. If it's this version, Not, again it's hard to hear so if you're playing it that way then it's five of the B and open E adding the six on the B and then down to three on the B then we got this riff so muted Tremolo picking, all on the bottom string. Open one, three, four. Open one, four, three. Then we've got this riff. So we're playing five of the G. No, we're not. We're playing five of the D and the open G. Then muted, open bottom string. First fret. Second fret up to third fret. Then we have this riff. So that's open bottom string to second fret of the A. Three on the bottom string to five of the A. Five on the bottom string to seven on the A. And then repeat that. And then we're gonna put a little hammer from seven to nine on the A. So basically we're just going up in fifths, so. And then over the top of that, we're going to put some harmonic. So harmonics on the 12 of the high E to the 12 of the B. 7 on the B to 7 on the G. 5 on the G, 7 on the B. And that goes over the top. Then we have this riff. So three on the bottom string, five on the D A and five on the D. Then six, five on the D. Five on the A, three on the D, uh, bottom string. Then three on the bottom string, five on the A and the D again. Then on the D, six, five, six, five. And then same again. And then power chord on the fourth fret of the bottom string. So slowly. Then we have So on the bottom string three four three Twice again on that three, up to four, then up to seven, and then we're going to do a semitone bend.
And then we're back into. That riff. And then we're back into. That riff. Then we finish the song on this riff. And we finish there on that third fret of the bottom string.